Hi, I'm Andrew Hazelden, and I thought I'd take a quick look at Resolve 15, and we'll see what we can do to make the compositing environment in the Fusion page more usable. So for starters, we can close the media pool, and we have our viewer. We can turn it to a two-view split or a single-view split. If we want to get more space in the user interface to work, we could unload all the nodes from the viewer by hitting the tilde key. We could switch to a single view if we want, and we could collapse the viewer by dragging the divider to go full screen. And we have the option here, we can either uh, pull the display up like this, or we can turn it off. So if it was visible, we could have it at the top. And now we have a screen, and instead of our limited area, if I zoom out, we can have a much larger canvas to work. If I zoom out further, we can work on a pretty large comp, and if I keep zooming out, we can work on a bigger comp. And if I zoom back in here, and bring the view back, what we've got is stereoscopic omnidirectional 360 rendering, and I can turn on stereo display. And we have a 3D scene, omnidirectional. And I could pop over and I could turn uh, it into a viewer here as if I'm riding the roller coaster. And I can turn off the stereo mode. If I want to turn the inspector back on, I can turn the inspector on. I can push it down to the sidebar and I can turn on the media pool if I wanted.